Hi guys, this is Angie from This Little Mitten Reborn Nursery and I am coming on today with a box packing video. Uh, this is James by Sandy Faber and he found a new mommy. So uh, I believe he is going to Florida. So he'll be leaving this cold, icky weather here in Michigan and going all the way down to Florida, so that is exciting. So, um, I have him in this really cute uh, outfit right here. It, um, it's like kind of like a quilted feel to it. It's white with gray edging, and it has um, uh, like black, gray, and white animals on it. So it's got zebras, uh, monkeys, alligators, elephants, frogs, tigers, uh, all kinds of little animals. And then it says hello in gray and black all over it. So I thought that would be a nice comfy outfit for him to go home in. Um, here, I'll grab the box. Uh, maybe we'll stick it right here. And so then I um, he doesn't come with a COA for some reason. I don't know if it's just Sandy favorite kits or what, but he doesn't come home with it or he doesn't come with a COA, but um, I do include uh, my nursery um, birth certificate. So this is what that looks like. Um, yeah, and I just put it in this little page protector. And then I have a thank you card. And he is going home with this um, really cute elephant plush lovely. It's gray and it's um, by Koala Baby and it rattles. Um, and then I'm also sending him home with this child of mine. It's brand new. I took the tags off of it, but it's just a child of mine um, short rocker and it has a, um, a blue collar and it's striped with um, like navy blue, um, a light blue, and a regular blue, and green, uh, and then it has a really cute little green alligator on it. So he'll go home with that. And then I have um, three diapers for him. So I have um, two honest diapers. One has the um, space theme on it and it has like spaceships and um, planets and stuff on it and then the next one is just the honest um, giraffe diaper and then the last one is oh I don't even know what this brand is maybe it's parents choice or I don't know but it looks like that and it has like lions and stuff on it so and it says once upon a giggle so lions and stars so those are the diapers he's going home with. Uh, I've grabbed this um, size 3 diaper for his head. So I figure that will fit over his head real well. Um, I put, I'm put i putting in this little scent packet that has um, gray elephants all over it. And it smells really good. Uh, it is... I don't know, just as multi-uses for scented sachets. Um, and it's eco-friendly, it contains essential oils, it's 100% biogradable, 30% recycled paper, and I don't, I mean, I don't remember what the scent is for this, but it really smells really nice. <laughs> um, so yeah, so I'll add that in the box to make it smell nice. And then I have his pacifier in this little um, bag, and he is just going to go home with the um, just the white nook passy like that. And it's already modified for him with the, with the um, magnet, so I'll stick that back in the little bag. And then let's see what else. And then this is the big plush blanket he's going home with. So I didn't have any blanket that was animal themed, um, unfortunately, because I, I don't know, I'm kind of fussy like that and I like to like match things. But um, 
yeah so this one it's really plush it is um, white or like a cream color and it just has a bunch of construction vehicles all over it it's really cute it's edged in red uh, it's like all primary colors and then the inside is really like you know really soft and plush and it's white so I like that too so let's go ahead and pick him up and I will put the blanket out here for him there we go put him back there we'll say bye bye to him bye bye everybody wish me safe travels and we're going to go ahead and put the diaper over his head um, actually I think it's this way right yeah all right James mm -hmm. bye Alright, so now I am going to kind of think if I want to put his lovey in there with him or no, I think I'm just, well, I don't know. No, I think I'm going to just pack that separately. So I usually put, oh, i got to move him down a little bit. I usually put this part over his head first and then I will wrap him up on one side that and then I'll put up the bottom part like that and then I pull over this part like this so there it is like that and I did grab there it is I just grabbed a piece of white ribbon um, that I can tie around his blanket to keep it shut so I'll just do that. There we go. Okay. There he is. And let's see, what do we want to do next? Um, I guess we can wrap him in some bubble wrap next. Um, I'm sure he'll be really good. You know what? I think his blanket is probably plush enough. So, um, I think the only thing I forgot to grab was a trash bag. Um, I like to put them in a, in a bag um, to make sure that they uh, stay dry, especially right now. I mean, it's raining here, but so I'll have to do that, uh, but I'll put him out of the way and then we can grab a piece of tissue paper wrap up his outfit. Um, how about we do a red one? This blanket has some red on it. Get that out of the way. So here is his outfit. Um, I'm trying to think how I want to fold it here. I'm going to fold it like this. I guess. Um, and then we can also see is there anything else I want to put in there with it. I think I'll just put his passy on there too. So we'll just stick that in there. Um, he's also going home with a bottle. I think this is just a parent's choice bottle. Uh, it just it has gray elephants all over it. It's really hard for you to see, and it has a yellow ring. I'm just waiting for um, the silicone to dry because I put silicone in the nipple, the clear silicone, because uh, the mommy does want me to put um, fill it up with some milk. So I'm just going to use some magic milk for that because that's what I have right now. So I'm waiting for that to dry, and that will be the last thing that I stick um, in. Oops, I didn't fold this right. That would be the last thing that I stick in the box. I'm hoping to get him out in the mail tomorrow morning. So I'm to try to get to the post office tomorrow before it closes.
not the best wrapper. <laughs> Mommy gets him. I'm sure she will love him. She said that she had been looking for a James um, that was already done. So that worked out good for me. Because um, I prefer not to do customs. Uh, I like to just be you know creative and do the babies how I how I see them to be. But so yeah. There's that. Um, I think I'll leave the diapers unwrapped and the lovey too. So, um, yeah, I think, I mean, that's pretty much yet it. I'm just going to um, get a bag to put him in so that, and all the stuff in so that uh, in case it's raining, he doesn't get wet and ruined. And I'm just going to use... Uh, <laughs> This caramel corn box. Uh, all my kids are either in Cub Scouts or Boy Scouts, so we sell lots of popcorn. And I saw these boxes, and I figured these boxes will work perfect for um, sending my dolls in. So, anyways, uh, I want to thank everybody for watching, and I hope you enjoyed the video. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys. <laughs>